around 4.30 right now. It's highest setting. I'm gonna use a heat protectant. I'm just using Beyond the Zone Smooth Criminal. I'm just spray that in, especially my ends. I'm gonna divide this top section up. And then just depending on how much body I wanna give it, I'm gonna do more curls. So if I want more body, I'm gonna divide this into more sections. I'm gonna do three sections rather than two. I'm just gonna start from the back. And just take my curling iron. And just curl it back all the way up to the scalp. I'm gonna hold it in for about 10 to 15 seconds, just because the waves are looser. So this will kind of help ensure that they last a little bit longer and just open it and let it fall. Next section. Instead of curling it away from my face, I'm gonna curl it towards me. This will just make sure the waves don't all interlock with one another. And just let it fall in place without undoing the curl or wave. I'm gonna alternate the way I'm curling so this is gonna to go towards the back. If you have really damaged hair or just really fragile hair that doesn't take the heat very well, you might wanna keep the heat lower, but I'm turning it all the way up just because I think I have, my hair will just hold a cur the curl better that way. So now I'm gonna do this other side. Okay, so now the bottom section is done. So I'm just gonna let that curl, kind of give it some shape and let it cool. And then I'm gonna take the top down. For this top section, I think I'm gonna make the curls go in all the same direction, just because I think it'll frame my face a little bit better if they're all kind of going the same way. Okay, so the part around my face, I kind of wanted to do last in a more like thinner section. If you have bangs, it's kind of tricky, but I just kind of give them a bit of a curl back just to help them lay or blend in with the rest of the hair. So after my, all my hair is done cooling, I'm just gonna finger comb it. I think that's very important in the overall look. You don't want to brush it out. This is kind of a soft hold hairspray, so that'll keep the hair soft and bouncy. And if you like to give your hair a little more volume, you can just tease the crown a bit. That is the finished look. Just very easy, soft loose and big waves, but it makes a big difference as you saw what my hair looked like before. So yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.